I participated in uh, a study about the aging brain uh, for people 50 years of age and older. Um, basically, they were looking to see if playing video games would help improve the memory of older people. So having a wide variety of individuals who are participating in studies allows us to really drill down into the information that we get and to do conduct um, analyses that compare subgroups, like we can compare men and women, men versus women. We can compare um, minorities with non-minorities or Hispanics uh, versus non-Hispanics to see if there are differences. Well, I'm in a study. Uh, they are trying a drug out uh, that will help with my scleroderma. It's important that in research there is a large diversity of people participating in research because most research that has been done so far includes just a specific group of mainly Caucasian here in the U.S. And now, um, actually, Hispanics are like the largest and fastest growing minority in the U.S. and they're underrepresented in research. Well, not only is it important for me, for my seizures to hopefully improve, but also that they'll be able to learn from my seizures to prevent someone in the future from going through what I went through the last 30 years dealing with the seizures. The study I participated in was for healthy adults versus unhealthy medicated adults between the ages of 20 and 80 to see if medication plays any part in hearing loss. I decided to become a study volunteer at the time because my mother was being fitted for hearing aids. If medication plays a role in hearing loss, the issue needs to be addressed. Although we are all have similar biological mechanisms, there are differences. There are biological differences and there are, there are cultural differences. If we don't have the representations of a large variety of people in research, then the knowledge is going to be limited to those who participate and they may not apply to everyone. I wanted to firsthand um, be able to, you know, say I, I helped if it, if it, you know, proved to help me, you know, then that would help others. And I, you know, would feel kind of good if I was able to help someone else other than myself. Well, I think it's important um, to participate in research studies because it helps us uh, find new ways to help people and improve their health. And I've always held the belief that we should leave the world a little better than than it was when we came in, even if it's our small corner of the world.